Hi, my name is Amy Pearl and you're watching Pearl's Project. Today we are going to be making candy sugar. into Marble Slab and was inspired because they had these beautiful, ginormous candy apples. I knew that I couldn't eat an entire candy apple, um, way too much candy, way too big, huge mess, and thought we need to make this more simple um, and more fun. So I thought, what a great idea, let's make some smaller sliced size versions of these candy apples um, and wanted to just do it and share it with you guys. Let's start with the basics. You're going to need an apple, caramel, white chocolate, dark chocolate, and then some fun creative toppings like nuts, butterfinger, Reese's Pieces, sprinkles, peanut butter. Have fun with it and be creative. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to slice our apple. I cut the apples about a quarter of an inch to an inch. I try not to cut them too thick because we have to allow enough room for the kebab stick. Um, if it's too thin, it will crack down the middle. Okay, so now we're gonna warm up our chocolate and our caramel. All right, we've got my, I've got my caramel, two different types of chocolate. We're gonna stir it up. White chocolate and dark chocolate. Mmm, it's gonna be so good. Alrighty. Now, for my first one I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a little guy right here. And I'll just put it a little bit in the caramel. All right, here we go. Fun. Okay, and then once you've and then once you've dipped a few, you can put them on some parchment paper and let them dry. Whether you're entertaining a group or you're just looking for something fun and creative for dessert, candy apples are a fun way to go. My name's Amy Pearl, and you're watching Pearl's Projects, a simply sophisticated way of living. Sugar.